I use Facebook and LinkedIn and a tiny bit of Twitter. Facebook I only use for personal to keep up with friends around the world. I use it fairly regularly but I'm not addicted to it. Just basically Facebook to see what's happening with my friends and to keep in touch. I've got a couple of friends who live in America, I've got a couple of friends who live in Australia. Uh, it's just a cheap way to keep up to, up to track on what they're doing. Instead of ringing them at you know, £2 a minute, I'd rather you know, have, a ch have a chat with them over Facebook Messenger. I've got an iPad so I FaceTime my children and sisters. Not too often, but I like to like share links. You know, like I don't want to bombard people because then they're just not going to listen, right? But I think I think maybe facts and videos that you like come across that are worth sharing. I use it for skateboarding to arrange with my mates, other meetups, um, share a few pictures and videos and tricks and things like that. I live on my own, so I don't really get to go out much because I've got a daughter. So it's my way of talking to people and knowing what's going on. I'm the wrong age, really. You know, I use it, but I'm not. It's not part of my life like it is with the kids. I only really use Instagram to share photos and see what other people are doing, and there's a lot of like. You can keep up to date with like trends and stuff on it as well. I use Twitter to like keep updated on like my favourite celebrities and stuff. LinkedIn because it's to do with a business. Uh, Twitter, I just love Twitter. It's a way to communicate. I'm I represent uh, twenty odd thousand people. Um, I I can't speak to everyone every day, but I can use Twitter as a means of communicating with those who want to. I use Twitter quite a lot, um, mainly because it's short and quick and. It, I'll read it for things like the news or catch up on the, the football news. I use it on my phone, on my iPhone, and I'm probably checking it every couple of hours just when I get a quiet five minutes. I just like to see what's going on with it, and even the traffic as well. It's really useful for that, the trains. It's useful because you find out South West trains, what's running and what isn't. Social media, I run a business from it, so I use Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn. Use them all to it's mainly for marketing. I use it in regards to business because we have to, because it's a big part of most business strategies these days. In regards to personally, I'm quite a private person, I'm quite introvert, so I don't do it. I used to use Facebook and it was a waste of time and I got uh, closed it down. Was Habit turning into something more addictive. It's a popularity contest that I've got absolutely no interest in being part of. Take a picture of your food, your dog, whatever. It uh, doesn't appeal to me at all. When I want to talk to someone, I like to speak to them in person. Oh, I use WhatsApp because that's free. I use that a lot. And my daughters used to WhatsApp from Thailand and places they were travelling in. And so that's brilliant. Probably used it about 10 times today. WhatsApp, uh, emails, LinkedIn. Two purposes. The first one is for the professional reasons and the other one is for family and friends. A bit old for it, but uh, our children have gone worldwide in different ways with work and stuff. And we found Facebook, Skype, everything was brilliant for keeping in touch. Music daily, 